So when you're running, it's so important that you're focusing on your breathing. Because a lot of players, when they're running, especially when they get tired, they start to hold their breath. And if you're not breathing, you're not getting oxygen into your muscles. So when you're running, just focus on nice, steady breaths. In through your nose, out through your mouth. And hopefully you can hear me on the microphone here, but I'm just breathing nice deep breaths. In through my nose, getting good oxygen. Out through my mouth. Okay, and let's see if I can go for a little sprint here. A little change of direction, get a little more tired. <clears throat> All right, so when you're getting tired here, this is where it's really important. Get lots of oxygen. Keep that breathing steady. So let's say like the ball was out of play <clears throat> and you got a chance to get back into position. You're resting for a second. You're still aware, but you're resting. This is where you focus on your breathing. Recovery. Okay, real deep breaths. I will send the better in one day soccer blueprint to anyone who comments hashtag soccer on this video. Good oxygen in, good carbon dioxide out. And then the game's on. And now it's a little more steady. It's not as intense with your breathing, but the rhythm is still there. Okay, so like I said, <clears throat> when you're running, so, impor so important that you focus on your breathing. If you're holding your breath, you're not getting good oxygen into your muscles. You're gonna cramp up easier. You're gonna get tired quicker. So focus on your breathing. In through your nose, out through your mouth. When you do have the chance to recover, let's say you went for a long sprint or you had to press, you had to tackle, you had to defend with intensity and the ball's out of play or you have time to rest while plays on the other side, you're still staying focused. You're still aware of what's going on, but focus on your recovery. Okay, and one more little thing I want you to think about. You probably see professionals do this all the time. There's a little snot rocket. Just blowing the mucus, the mucus out of your nostrils. Okay, it's tough to have a nice deep breath if you're sucking back mucus. And basically mucus is bacteria. You don't wanna be sucking that back into your body. Your body's trying to get rid of that. So it's okay to spit. It's okay to quickly blow some snot out of your nose. It'll help you breathe better. It's just a little trick. Something I do all the time and you see professionals. If you want to improve faster and achieve more this season, use the Soccer Success Planner. It's 100% free. Players all around the world have already used it to improve. You can download it right now. There's a link in the description below. If you don't know about me, I used to be a huge underachiever, but through obsessive self-improvement, I found my success. Earned a college scholarship, played for my national futsal team, a YouTube channel with over 100 million views. I've helped players worldwide, and I'd love to help you improve faster and achieve more. From moving up divisions to making national teams, players who use the Online Soccer Academy get results. Access elite level coaching and training, become a complete player, make a difference on the field, and get noticed when you play. Limited spots available. Apply today, start improving tomorrow, link in the description below.